Hey guys, Steve Alexander here with SAMTV. Hey, uh, last couple weeks ago, I posted a video on my bike hunt. And um, because of that, I got some amazing comments and suggestions on bikes, other than the two that I listed. So since then, I've been looking around and I'm waiting on my new bike. It's been ordered. I'm just waiting for it to come in. I guess with COVID and everything, everything's a little slowed down and backed up. But went down to my local bike shop, one of the few places around here that actually rent out a bike or demo a bike. And um, I found a place right down the road in Fuquay Marina in North Carolina. And uh, I rented this amazing little bike. It's a Scott Spark. This is the 950. This is the 2019 version and the 2020 version. There's a couple, I haven't seen that many reviews on it, but I want to tell you, um, this is not a massive long travel bike, uh, but it is an, an amazing bike. I've had it out for a couple of days now, took it out for about two and a half hour ride yesterday with some buddies and it performed flawlessly. It's got some cool features and um, if you want, hang on for a minute, I'm gonna take you through a little, you know, step by step of some of the features on this bike. I hope you enjoy it. Um, any comments or questions, you know, leave them below. I'll leave a link to this bike in the description below as well. Also to the bike shop in Fuquay. It's one of the, it's a new shop and they were just phenomenal. Um, most of the shops around here just aren't renting bikes out right now. And they were super accommodating, made you feel really like you were the only person in the shop. And I think they are limiting it to two people in the shop at the moment. So you're close to the only person in the shop. But um, but seriously, it just was a great experience. They really know what they're doing there. They're, they're really bike lovers and they really seem to enjoy their job. So just want to give a big shout out to them. I'll link. I'll put a link to their shop in the description below as well. Thanks so much, guys. Check this bike out right now, the Scott Spark 950. So hey guys, today we've got the Scott Spark 950. It's a nice bike, so I'm 5'10", 31 inch inseam. So I was riding the large. Um, sit kind of really felt really good. Uh, up front, you've got the Fox 32 Rhythm. Really nicely done. I think this is a 120 millimeter travel on the front end. And as well as your rear, you've got the Fox Float Elite. Also 120 millimeters of travel. And I'm going to talk about that little red dial there in a little bit. But um, just so you kind of can get a clear picture of what, how this thing travels. Take a look at this. A couple of little runs we did in some local trails here and um, it's pretty ruddy. It's been raining a lot this winter and into the spring and this thing really held up well. Uh, on the rear end you've got the Eagle 12. Uh, it's the SRAM NX version and uh, like I said the 12 speed really really climbs well. That pretty much anything you can point this thing at it can climb it if you can hold on to the bike you can get up and down pretty much anything you want um, it's only real shortcomings is simply in its overall travel limited to 120 mils of travel it's got a dropper post um, it's a hundred and twenty five millimeter dropper post on the small and 150 on the medium and large and extra large. There's two little levers here. See that one on top is your dropper and that lower one is actually a control for the lockout. So you can lock out your front and rear travel at two stages down to 180. I mean from 120 to 80 and this is your front fork. That's the little lever that turns right there. And that's what that little red button is on the rear travel. So that'll lock you out to either zero or 80 millimeters. Keeping you grounded, it's got some 25 millimeter rims on here. They're alloy, obviously, the Synchros. And then we've got some Maxxis Recons. They're the 29, obviously, it's a 2.4s are on this. And they kind of keep you on the trail nice and smooth um, they're a really good fit for this bike again this is a kind of a crossover bike from cross country to trail bike um, I almost put this a little bit more in a trail bike category but it's a tiny bit short like you kind of feel it as you're on the road here that you uh, almost deep descents um, if they're really steep it's gonna feel a little less than perfect as far as slackness goes but as you kind of see even here trying to get up on uh, these, these banks, I mean, you just don't have enough forward reach 
to really climb uh, out of something that's crazy steep and you got to kind of watch a little bit on some of your descents we got shimano uh, brakes on this thing and uh, they're ample i mean um when i first got it uh, it took a little bit you know to get used to i wish they were maybe like the next level up like the 8100s maybe so there you go that's a look at the scott spark 950 like i said take one last little uh, peek at it here uh, I, th I really speak pretty highly of this bike. I think it's a great bike. Um, and also just a quick shout out again to Torrenti Cycles in Fuquay Varina. I will leave a link in the description below. Uh, definitely check those guys out if you're in the area. They can help you out. They are both a Scott and Ibis authorized dealers. Thanks for checking in guys. I uh, hope to see you guys on the trail again soon. Take care.